out there from Grant Flower, and maybe that's what they were waiting for. Got him with the solo ball. That's the end of Grand Flower, and well bowled Rajab Ali. Heads up cricket. Well, that was right in the block hole, and a slow one at that. And it beat him completely. He was absolutely mesmerized by that ball. He was already committed for the stroke. You see that swell up into the block hole, hitting the center stump, sludging them, and Grand Flower had no answer to that at all. And the fall of that wicket, Zimbabwe 104 for three. That could be out, it is. Edward Adumbi takes the catch. And it's still not completely over. Look at the jubilation. I mean, they have almost lost this game. Uh, in the sense that there are only about 27 runs to go. And um, a catch is taken now, just the fourth wicket gone. And look at the jubilation amongst the fielders. As he tries to pick up on the rise, doesn't get a proper hold of it. A thick, um, it hit the up of the bat. And a good catch by Edward Udumbe at... Uh, mid on so at the fall of that wicket Zimbabwe 108 for four sparing die from Rajab Ali oh, that's going to be close yeah. he's given yeah. and Rajab Ali dismisses the skipper who for the third time has gone without reaching double figures in this World Cup and Zimbabwe well they're in a bit of trouble at the moment well, just goes uh, half cock ball is straight in line and uh, wasn't forward that much to get the advantage. Then Andy Flower goes for five, Zimbabwe 113 for five. 